Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I will show you how to clone a Windows 11 and 10 to a new SSD hard disk without using any third party software. If your C drive is full on your PC is slowing down, this method will be help to move to Windows 10 to a bigger drive while keeping everything intact. As you can see my C drive is full. I want to move to Windows a larger hard drive to keep this system running smoothly and make sure to have to a separate part and that will temporarily store your windows backup now hold the shift key and restart this pc and troubleshoot more from the menu select the troubleshoot advanced option and command prompt at this stage i am opening notepad from the command prompt to identify my current window partition and the data partition where the backup will be saved as you can see my windows partition is change the d drive and data drive is c once confirmed enter the backup command show on your screen i have changed the path because my c drive is backup.bim and kept the d drive in win backup and press the enter backup create start successful here you can see that the backup.vim file has been successful created next i open the disk management to confirm the new hard disk in detect my new hard disk is detect i have select the gpt and ok now open the command prompt administrator yes open a command disk path select disk list disk list disk i have select disk 1 new my hard drive disk 1 Now I have to create a partition C R E P A R E F I size is equal to 1 by 2 enter. Next part is actually in creating the second partition 152 MB. And next one is format This command to a create a system boot files copy in this drive. Disk part is actually format this volume. The assign letter is S. Use the command shown the list disk. Pick a new disk and create a EFI boot partition. As you can see, the EFI partition successful create 512 mb and unlock it space right click the new partition new simple volume next 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 and volume is i have select the w next and name is windows next finish mm. Now open the CMD command. W partition is now ready to follow window installation. Run as administrator. Yes. Open the command now. CMD run as administrator. The W partition is now to ready for install the windows. And select the partition where is your image file. JR. the image file is backup.bim and I have a type this command and click enter now I am going to start the backup.bim for to a D drive to the W drive using the apply image command for show on the screen once the image is applied the next step is active the boot partition my boot partition is assigned letter 
S. The operation completes successfully. Once the image is applied, the next step is activate the boot partition. My boot partition assign the letter S. I show you my boot partition is assigned letter S. And I have a type a command. The type command link in description. You check it. The command is BCD boot windows F to EFI enter boot file successfully created and restart the my PC boot the new hard drive and that's it all. The cloning is complete. Now I restart the computer. It select my new hard drive, 18 GB hard drive from the boot menu. We are successful. Boot in Windows and the new drive is now showing. So now I will restart the computer. Select my new hard drive, 80 GB on the boot menu. Now I restart the computer. Select the new GB hard drive to boot menu. We are successful. Boot menu window. The new drive show in the C drive. I have confirmed the windows drive, open the disk management, again you will see the partition and new drive, one for the boot device and one for the window installation device. Let me open the chrome demonstration my google account, let me open the chrome and demonstrate my google account is still login meaning all data has been saved. Thanks for watching, if you found the tutorial helpful please give me the like subscribe and the channel, see you in the next window tutorial.